many have suspicions that the remains found were not of Brian Laundry. However, we now get to hear what Dog the Bounty Hunter thinks, as well as his reasons for thinking so. Dog the Bounty Hunter said one indication for him that the remains do not likely belong to Brian Laundry was the lack of reaction from his parents when the remains were found. Alberta Laundry seemed to wipe away just a single tear after being informed that her son's remains were only a few feet away from her. Being a mom who gave birth to him, one would expect her to scream, collapse, or at the very least sob openly. However, he noted that both parents showed almost no emotion, which was not a normal reaction of a parent who lost a child. Another odd aspect, raised by Dog the Bounty Hunter, was that the dentist involved in Brian Laundrie's case was a relative of the Laundries. The FBI earlier announced that the skeletal remains discovered at the Mayakahachi Creek Environmental Park belonged to Laundrie after a comparison to known dental records. According to Dog, the dentist that identified the dental records of Laundrie was his very own uncle. Dog thinks the Laundry family has pulled it all off with some help from the authorities. Because of this craziness surrounding the case, Dog the Bounty Hunter noted that for him, there's a 50-50 chance it's not Brian.